The Gunners legend has dubbed Mustafi the king of blunders after the German center back gave away a penalty in the 75th minute of the game, which was duly put away by Harry Kane to level the match. Petit, who won the double with Arsenal in his first season, was not happy with Mustafi's performance during the game. And the 48-year-old World Cup winner was even surprised to see the Mustafi in the starting 11. Arsenal boss Unai Emery left a few notable names on the bench against Tottenham, with Mesut Ozil, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang and Lucas Torreira all out of his starting lineup. The Gunners was at the back, have been well documented, and Mustafi found himself in the unfamiliar position of right back at the start of the match. Arsenal made a dream start on taking the lead at Wembley after just 16 minutes, when Aaron Ramsey calmly rounded Hugo Lloris before slotting the ball home. Then, with 15 minutes left in the game, referee Anthony Taylor awarded Spurs a penalty when Mustafi was deemed to have pushed Kane over in the box. Despite replays showing the England striker might offside in the build-up, Petit saw fault with the 26-year-old defender. I was surprised to see him start, Petit said. He is the king of blunders. And he wasn't the only former gunner to be frustrated with Emery's selection. Ian Wright took to YouTube to vent his anger at the final whistle. It's frustrating, it feels like a loss to me to be totally honest, Wright said. Especially if you look at some of the referee's decisions. Obviously their goal, the penalty was offside. But then Mustafi again, his fingerprints are all over the crime scene pushing him in the back. With only nine games left in the season Arsenal currently sit fifth in the Premier League, one point off Manchester United in fourth, and one point above Chelsea in sixth. Next up for Arsenal is United at home on Sunday in a clash which could be the decided on who secures the final Champions League spot.